to my channel and thank you so much for choosing to do the to view the welcome you to my channel and thank you so much for choosing to do I am Paula Dimu, the advocate of Ijozi, and once again, I welcome you to my channel, and thank you so much for choosing to view this video. Well, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, I suggest you do so and click on the notification button so that you are notified every time I upload new content on the channel. Well, on today's video, I'll be unpacking around the aspects of Umsama so that we understand why and what and when we should do all these things so that we are knowledgeable in terms of looking after Ahmad Luziwetu or rather looking after our bloodline or inheritance or lineage whatever you want to call it so in these previous videos I've been talking about the processes around that and I also touched on a very important aspect of bringing the deceased home and that is a very essential or rather important part but before we can look at having the deceased being brought home or rather because I told you that in this chapter we are at, we are starting over because we are undoing all these misconceptions, all these wrong things we've been doing. So let's start from the beginning. So in terms of bringing Amaluzi Ekaya, before you first need to look at the aspect of Umsam. So Umsam because we have Umsam which is an altar or rather Osuge where else whenever or however nenza is in those sekai that is when you hamba new bigger or gunu muto shadai or gun in ganeza lie or someone is going to school or nibong and generally um of anything of that relation then we say when this are then we have one's personal altar right that is when you realign or connect with the high self or rather link yourself to the spirit you know that is what you can have at your own personal you know usage or rather you know at your own personal want whenever however and wherever and then basically i will take you to the part where now we touch on other aspects of different umsamu that follows after that but when we silanda madlozi ematunini or rather silanda abantu abadala sithi sibabuyise ekhaya into kuqala efuze siyibheke ukuthi is umsama wasekhaya uhlelekile na noma izinto zilungisiwe so first things first umsama owenziwa phi that is the main question Umsam uwenziwa emakaya amadala and mangiti ikaya eldala. It can be ga koko, it can be ga koko. Kabo mama, nizo wenza ga koko, o wakabu baba ni wenze, but it has to be either ga koko or noma ga koko, right? So why you must ask me why I'm always referring to koko koko because it's a it's a maternal instinct and it's all aligned to the womb because remember they are the ones that birth these generation yes abum kulu came and brought the sperm but in the land is the the the, the womb of abokoko so even on the paternal side nizo linka indawo yokuthi oh kukha abokoko so that is the homes you look at in terms of uwenziwa umsam. So if ikaili laga koko or no malaga koko li corner and it is not look after, you first start there. Try and clean up the place because we always emphasize about having umsam, but the important aspect is that amaloza wa shali enda wen enolite. So now if ga koko guna mu guna mle se ga koko nikashisile o ga koko nikashisile. That is sometimes a very tricky situation because that is going to be able to serve as security around that. Because if and all of you decide to go back to your homes, then it tends to be a problem because that says like I said, the generations of, 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 of ancestors we are going to be is a very different one because is 
and now we don't know whether to move left or to move right but with this few directions i hope we'll have the clarity that we need this is how we move so if ekaya lelo niyazi ukuthi kunomuntu ohlala lapho then niyalisebenzisa lelo ukhaya lelo elaka khokho onoma elaka khokho but someone might be arguing say but mpho um there is not necessarily you know um, um a home that we can call our own so i say to you is there a house or a home that you have that you reside in that that kuhlala abantwana balelo ukhaya or is owned by an elder or someone of the house or someone of the family it can be your home it can be your aunt's home but it should be linked to la madlozi and so then one later a car because once um some when ziwa oh shala lapo permanently unless otherwise you don't know really is a or whatever the case might be but um some was a car it is a something of permanency it's not something you can take with you and travel with you once babu you saw about that dollar a car would you are going to do some of cool that is where we will link because um some serves as where we link to our mantles way to because we would normally go somewhere so you're partly my tuning or no muscle connect and i might lose it in my tuning but one signal some and it cuts all the admin of going to the grave site where else now oh my gosh at the kaya oh my kaya um i'm i'm going to do anything going to just go in whatever the case might be we now link amaro's way to to our present existence using um sam so um serves as a very big thing i could go on and on and on but let me get to why i'm here today so you need to prepare for them in that extent in knowing neo when zangupi umsam so it's very important that as a family ni shale panze ni discussele ento lena because you cannot nenzo umsam emkashwe ni maingi temkashwe ni you cannot do that if you are renting an apartment if you are renting at an estate you need to have umsam ekaya eksuge gui of a permanent residency niya zuguti no matter what even if lababa suge wa kona at that particular time should they pass on then niyazi ukuthi umsamu uzohlezi ukhona ekhaya ekuthiwa no fuze siyobike umsamu wasekhaya sense izinto zasekhaya so now a typical example let's say uyolanda amadlu zakhabo mama akho or okay let's say uyolanda amadlu zakhabo mama akho and um 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 ikhaya ilkhona elakini so that's what you do nizobikela amadlozi and let them know the situations around ukuthi kwenzakalana manje and why umsamu omkhulu sizinzomisa ekhaya leli and sizinzomisa kulo batshele ukuthi siyabona ukuthi no one else is going to be able to look after you but us but amadlozi nawo abikela respectively because the whole process na khona of ukulanda umuntu remember along the way you need to tell them ukuthi manje sesi stop sign siyajika siyangena manje we are almost approaching home etc etc and you redirect them until that spirit is safely home and guided by you and welcomed properly by you you know so then on some level you look at now this is the home we are choosing now is this home clean enough when we speaking about clean is this home spiritually aligned is this home clean can we put amadlo zilana because sometimes you might find ukuthi nenza la mas le misebenzi lena ebuisa amadlo zi ekhaya but you find ukuthi amadlo zuma fike getin ayanqaba because of the filth or rather the unhealthiness or the toxicity esuke isegqekeni so things that align to toxicity around our homes are negative spirits that are wondering am i just in way to or mshampe you bought that house and it was not aligned maybe no monto was shown in a lap or generally just good news into that energies that are not aligning with the energies of amadu zuako or mshampe loyo muzlo use gen ziwe utagatiwe or whatever the case might be or good news into she is in a correct a car so that is when we now look out and say siyahamba siyohlola noma siyothola a third opinion that is in instances where i would rather of a house calls in terms of the situations but generally you can just go to consult you know nifunu kwazi ukuthi umuzo kanje nakanje is it okay but let us also stop as easy zangoma or easy nyanga or whatever you call yourself lying to these dear people that come to you because it is very 
Ray to go and consult and you're being told to know your home is clean. Every time, Bazoti, Umuzu Nolile, and you must ask Umulile, Umuli Soranjan, you know, my Umule, to what extent? Because I want to say, who named me take good jelly, Dini, who named Fair, Naki Jamara Lapo under the ground, or something along those lines. But Nancy said, to a certain extent, we need to be logical in terms of how we're using our thinking or other thought process. You've never ever encountered um Nitini Heli Lapo, who are out of the blue, toilet paving, yeah, because they out of proportion or good on Tabat and you don't know what's if we are goopy because remember, almost miles of figure go where at the go yellow gafagis in the HRT lapo. And you should also as was keeper. So in your mind, you must think of good listen to a swagger name. Nias would have zank any genies and just some for so long and shy lapa than the ground has always been level. But let not someone come and say Uzo keeper is into HRT because between you and I. And now me personally, I've experienced that thing. People are coming, they're carrying these things that they are carrying. And then when you're not looking well, busy, confused about everything that's going on, then they act as though they brought the, those things themselves. So sometimes in terms of looking after the yard or whatever the case might be, generally, but I always say stick to a iwasho namanzi or amatwai because sometimes you'll go to the extent of imiti because it is a tricky situation if uzopumutati fuzengini se umuzi. Then umuntumaga figa atini sumuza fagi miti, amatlo zumani tu na fage kaya. They not vibing with what's been put again because they're saying like we are here but you've 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 installed these extra satellites what are they for remove these dirt before you can come in so that is why i need to find someone genuine and honest and to be able to assist you moving forward in terms of Assessing the home in general. Sometimes Matiwa maybe the house go goodness boggy because this is a common thing. You tiwa goodness boggy. A person must be able to uh, take you through the process so they need born what is happening. So that because there are certain things if the knees born if injury maybe goodness boggy or something along those lines, maybe you know, isn't or as like there's a lot of things. But I think we'll have to unpack this this into another video because it is so much, you know, to 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 really touch on. But you go and then you consult and then get a survey of saying, good to know, this is the damage in Lini or in Lini good clean. Oh no, generally, Tolani washes in Klope ni Kheli Kheli Lonke and, 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 or ni Tola Matwa ni Kheli Kheli Lonke or whatever. But between you and I, black or African child or white colored Indian, whoever you are watching this video, make sure that every now and then you just cleanse or purify the space you reside in. You could either use salt, you could either use um, um, e-wash or, or just general water that has been prayed over or that's why people opt for or rather amanzo because that is purer and it tends to see eyes on in bacteria spiritual bacteria so it tends to keep your yard clean and sanctified at all times once in a while that is important because life is spiritual and energies are everywhere but good my case that are serious where you see good see or whatever the case might be and then you get to see you know you get to go to it but if someone is going good to also keep her uno popi or or you need to sit down and think look at the make of the doll you know clap putting a pep or something and they're coming and saying this was there from 1900 and you're like okay <laughs> and you know as in is in though we just need to look at them because the alum is a lesson to us kind of two or seven that i won't pour today this was an alo no popular nina mazan dagi is in to ilash and lola books yay nai and you think ah then you just been scammed so it's one of those things we need to look at so you go get that analysis or rather sorted out but it's important i say you would say because you cannot jump the stage of wanting to know good is in the way appropriate is it safe is it you know can we carry on or is there certain things that we need to do but let us refrain from being too quick to accept immunity being 
put in our homes or being put you know in our in our in our place of residency because we never really know how the impact of leo mitileo because sometimes it is like Nisa Gante, as in is as so not all ancestors or normal amalosi link themselves to the usage of imiti so Boy. so those are certain things that you need to look at so now Moving forward, we now established Lugutu Swenza Gupumsam, Sahamba, Sayotola, Sayolungisa, and then the aspect is now going to the grave sites and so big amadlozi and so you should know so you know so you know so you know so you and then you plan around the finances of that so oh my almost is so long see we get where's a woman profit or whoever we're looking so we're looking so kaya now where are we putting long some runner that is the big question because in terms of um some was you need to know what i'm a cash and is a little bit is little so sometimes i'd say it's important to go to if amandla akhona bakheleni umuzi ngaphandle if amandla awekho then if ku ekhaya kunesihlahla then ningababekela but in your mind don't say ukuthi amandla uzama ahleli like la ngaphansi kwesihlahla come rain come sunshine no ni wabekela ukuthi mawufike amandla uzakhululeke ekhaya because sometimes especially when ikuba ni amandla uzawafani and sometimes amakhehla don't necessarily like to be babanda kanye nezalukwazi so sometimes you find ukuthi maybe abogogo they might be fluid and you know allow themselves to be in the house but abanyeke they don't allow but the so the mistake that we always do is siyathatha umsam so ufake ekamereni or rather the main bedroom so sometimes that tends to be tricky if umuntu uhlala lapho with their spouse or whatever the case might be because the main bedroom it is perfect if uguno and there's no gibberish going on when i speak about gibberish there's no boyfriend and girlfriend going on around the house because coming back to amakaya waboko so the main bedroom should be respected at all time ngamane nalali sumuntu ongakashadi lapho noma umuntu that will not be having any sexual relations actually in the bedroom because umsam uyahlonisha but i i i hate this thing of all these people saying no let us think bigger than that and actually have honor for our ancestors, you know. Sometimes I'm a charit waiter, I will call that big. If it's a charit like in a space, decorate that place, make it look proper, standard, and but in the instance of maybe the house not having a space, then that is where we, we come to the part of saying either Nyahamba, Nyofuna, a tree stump a tree trunk um maybe a half but sometimes i always say look for that one that splits or has that goes two ways or something or even if maybe it can have um um, um maybe uh, something that branches out but just minimal now let her end especially if there's no tree again then you know what um, this is because but um, I don't want to confuse you. I want you to understand why things are done the way they are done. You know, so then you need to be able to say, um, we are part of the because that is a neutral place. No one is going to be able to have sex close to that place. That place will always be respected. But if you are not able to have sex close to that place, then you will be able to But everything, remember, should face in Pumalana. I'm trying to focus, but I'm getting so much messages at once. <laughs> okay. So make sure good man begala ni begala gupi empumalanga. Yon kinto yeni ipe gupi empumalanga because isn't it na bonong ala be bali li konan basu se kona. They were facing the east, meaning sunrise, life, and all these things in between. Because one thing we need to know, good um, amalozi are not some demons or dark entities or whatever. We are bringing life a kaya because once you bring your ancestors home, you must know good your vault or your bank or whatever it is it is secured um someone is your vault is your bank so if there is no security around that it means but once you you embark and on that then your vault or your bank is secured there won't be transactions as you'll be notified about anything and no sticky hands can come through and take ama funds or sekai because ama will be working overtime to protect what is of yasekai 
So I will definitely come on to um, um, the setting up of, of, of Um Sam on our, next video, on our next video. So that is the whole significance when we say um Sam um kule kaya, gula spatla kona, etc. Anyone is doing anything, we are anything that serves as um Sam um kulu. But then we have your own personal altar. So that one I care to get. You can have it in Koshinwako, whatever the case might be, but avoid having having your personal altar established at a boyfriend's place i did touch on this on a video i did about cohabiting go back and check that out but have umsamako at your place of residence because man no samum kule kai you're able to say bo go nga mangaling wana miscast like tini nishilala a number 12 what 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 at what what estates and then you go do your personal altar there and then uya wazu gutu connect na majo wako na baba ya wazu gutu bazo vusela nga pezu wako because they know gutu ugu upi na unogu patla abezo ugu kali speaker gutu toko zani ugu koko hii muzbandu and they'll be sitting la pendi and saying uban manje lo calling our names and uban uban joshu ya muza gutu bani but it's important that everyone is introduced there your lives everything is is basically it's a start over type of situation so that now wherever you are you know what i'm going to be doing one to three but whatever whatever the case might be because but my protocols around this but let us say wherever you are staying you decide to uh, you must know that you cannot slaughter generally because they got pride and i know you 80% of us sihlala ema burps so you cannot necessarily say ukuthi um uzohlabini kuku because they'll call um 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 you know fpca on you you know you being cruel animal cruelty so that is why i'm saying good isn't just fun and good to know you go and do all those things a kaya because if good sister my elders a kaya then kwa legi le good see in fact she sell a kaya or ni seven is some summer sakai if there are no elders because man seven is some summer sakai all of you will be coming together and saying good to now we are meeting for this purpose but your personal altar or when you are speaking to your creator and that is where you connect to Amadlozwako because not in particularly you want to connect to all Amadlozi because manini, you must be so good imagine these centuries and centuries of ancestors so sometimes we are part generally maybe you want to connect to your mom that has passed over maybe you just want to connect to you know your goggles and all those but the National Assembly. That is when this access again Maybe you have a calling or whatever the case might be. Then it's umsamasekaya. But now we're in your place of stay. If you're gonna have your own personal altar, make sure that you don't put your altar where you are having cloth cloth. Respect that. Respect umsamako. At least put it in a dignified state. And actually, you don't know. You don't owe anyone an explanation. I visited houses of people, especially um that have other beliefs. Um, nice. They have their nice altar. You come there. You know, kitty vibes, kitty vibes. But with us, it should be something that is, is put in the bedroom. If you have a nice space, then put your altar, you know, see, we beg, but make sure that you also protect the type of energies that come into your space because you cannot be having, excuse me, any gym jack and ch charity coming through and they bring unpure energy. So you need to actually filter that. So do as you please, Mom Samuako, make it like. You know, I'll come to that also when I'm touching on setting up Umsamo on our next video. And then we have Ge Ektiwa Am Hindumba. Hindumba is 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 where you go through and link yourself to your spiritual work. So lo umsam lo usugo boom samwani always sangoma no ma inyang sugi kona la pichardin. So lo umsam lo does not serve necessarily as that which connects you to all the ancestors, especially if um, or particularly maybe even so that is where you go back to the drawing board and figure out yourself where do we go from here because you saying but your paternal side has not been sorted your maternal side has not been sorted so that's why it's important that we understand the the the, the, the when 
that offers that Induma plays in our spiritual lives because Induma is not for everyone and Nakona it has its own spiritual responsibilities. So sometimes in the case of Ugui Sogomunde Kai, maybe we trust you find who that Numba operates, but I always call that an underground or illegal operation because you'd find Uguti the particular group of ancestors that have been accessed into the home. But Guna Mani Anga Pandi. Lawa Mani Angi Ningi visa yokta no tina petelum duana and they are able to come and access home. So we need to also know around that aspects and saying Guti that in Dumba Leo is is that healers or lesser school because it's a cooler that uh, school is altar that is where you connect with your gift connect with your people connect with those in line to your spiritual gift or rather calling and it is a great passage because now you're in Dumba alone you can connect to the losses at large because of the type of work you do but if we as a good you are operating illegally do the right thing because now you're serving the other better let us serve amalozwe to play delfanayo won't get but understanding the 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 the, the, the transitions or other spiritual hierarchy that they serve because they can be and that's why we tell you to go by name rumba a car that is where all the elders of Ekaya unite because now we understand. Amadlozi might operate in an outcome of Indumba, but the neutral or the neutral spot, so because as in using to and and they're not necessarily explained. It is important that we unpack them for you so that you understand better. So Lao Makanzelo Lao or whatever the case be, that should be just put as the elders of the home, um sam um wasikaya. That is where si pasha corner. But because a kaya gunendumba, we can slaughter and put anything that we can, maybe guleo outer leo. But when sting as she's in pepper or gunete balegile, that is why we amazing if um the, the house is big enough or umuzi mkulu or umunda has inherited or uvu sumuzi gababa um 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 gosh this is such a lengthy topic but uzo tolu guzi that is why gu pashe wa esbayeni or yo pasha my cat is by it when they need to connect in a um samu so go connect higher but when they now need to assemble you know the national assembly then they go is by it so it is a lot dear people that we need to like tackle but i will definitely get onto this to understand Uguti. we'll be having another session of this video because i'm trying to concentrate so much but there's so much messages that's coming it's like i'm unpacking but there's also this unpacking that's happening in my ears so i will definitely get to that so that we understand better or clearer because those are the aspects that we need to look at but let us not look after him somewhere to only spiritually but let it also be physically and last is suicide or ends in some corner make sure that house it is look after you cannot be bringing amazon and all these other things let us at least see long is like a homecoming ceremony paint the house if you have to do something if you have to because amadlozi will never forget us by tina siawa kotla by choice because it's their tanda so let us do the right things and understand the different implications of what we do or rather our link to the spiritual because that is why it's so weird when you're just praying out of the blue you 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 want to you know have an altar of some sort to say also light my candle lawako and connect to amadlozi it is important so it is not Something that we should be saying, yeah, was one man on a corner. That person or whoever on a corner, it means spiritually by a pillar. Some of us see clearly Lana Ganti spiritually, we are doomed, we we are non-existent. And if you're having your own personal altars, Kasia go bigger my altars, Enva women yang, Enva women or drop, Parat Gama or drop, so in the lazy. Let us be proud and bold. Yes, one might argue if you have a naughty son like mine. And I might be coming there and making messing everything up, then you can't have a normal altar, but also cooler eventually. Because in King Ayoguti, with it, our personal in some Esibanayo, Ia Shuga, there's also one that is for someone also get an and someone that just generally is 
gifted spiritually and just enjoys the connection to the spirit and someone who's just a general jane but loves to like connect to umdalwake and pray to amaluzwake so i'll definitely be impacting all those things when we come back with our next video but this was just a part one series showing you good see there's different aspects to imsam we all say imsam 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 but there is a lot to understand around these things are you using umsamwagini right umsamwagini law or was you usendawane right or do you need to start things over because you normally hear would see umsam umulile we get to those aspects only so we'll be unpacking on all those things on our next video but thank you so much for coming through and viewing this video I am the advocate of course Umpo Wabadimu signing out and don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Don't forget to like this video and do leave your comments down below. If you still haven't subscribed, I suggest you do so and click on the notification button so that you are notified every time I submit or rather post new content on the channel. May we grow, may we heal and may we flourish spiritually because that is the intentions for Amalus Wetu in our lives. Make your ancestors proud and take that decision to say you know what let me look after these these goggles and these mkulus and let me do the right thing it all begins with you because i always say ah uh, it ends with amal who's way to the generation of confusion moving forward we are a generation of direction so the question is what are you going to do with all this information that you are receiving are you going to just save it and download or you're going to act and actually bring your family together and understand because you might be against your whole family but someday it will all pay off so thank you so much for coming through this was another oh my Lucy video i am definitely signing out but i will see you very soon